guess she prefers practice to theory. Hmm? Why? Time to wake up, master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. After taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls, wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone. It only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. She wants to practice, she'll get to practice. Don't get mad at her. Why the hell not? The whippersnapper refuses to do as she's told. You like that about her? Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame. But this has to end. Now. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that, if she's to become one of us. I'll see you below. See why you were so eager to practice. Strike. the blindfold you've got work to do your reflexes are still slow maybe for a witcher think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations though in your shoes I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger disobeying his instructions unwise well yes but that book was horribly dull I know and you know that's no excuse <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Better not. Vesemir said if it does, he'll make you eat a bowl of slugs covered in salt. <laughs> you! <laughs> exactly. So you'd best behave. Come on. We'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? Of course. Is a witcher school or an elven bathhouse? Shoot to the bottom. Beat you to the bottom. <laughs> Maybe if you fall. What did I tell you about breathing? Through your mouth, in rhythm with your steps. Siri, cut it out. Anything to say for yourself, young lady? I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. 
At the very least, you want to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the panthera tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Hmm. So you did read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if... But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. So you did the reading. Why not admit it right off? Never pounce on an advantage as soon as it appears. Wait till it stands to have maximum effect. Uncle Vesemir's words. Well, you're a quick study. Quick, but mischievous. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Siri with a dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. What do you think? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Should work on the basics. Even skilled masters need to hone the fundamentals, and Ciri's barely a novice. Draw your sword, Geralt! Siri, see how Geralt holds his sword, its angle. What am I supposed to parry? If I can just dummy. Pretend now, live Not later. Bad. Repost! Strike! Counter strike! the day to a close, we'll go over a few witches' signs. Let's start with when. Siri, when is sometimes called the witches. Now watch carefully to see why. Cast Igni, Geralt. I want to see sparks fly. Not for the Quen sign, I'd be a flame by now. All right, Geralt, come on. See that, Siri? Hard will knock anyone. Time for Axie. Damn it. I hate this feeling. Geralt. Ah. See this, Siri? Couldn't move if I wanted to. Throw a bomb. Don't worry, Siri. Quen will dampen the blow.
Enough. Continue training at will. I'm too old for this shit. Showed him, kid. Siri, get down here. <laughs> A little she devil. As soon as she's back, we'll set her to polishing all the swords at Care Morhen. Find that helmet. Siri? Sure to find every last blade for you. <laughs> <laughs> 